Here we can see another example of a phishing attack where uh, this person, uh, K, is pretending to be a legitimate customer of Drapery Curtain Rods. First thing to look at is the sender name is different than the name that she signed here. So that's one indicator that this might not be a legitimate email. And the first thing you want to do also is check this link without clicking on it. If you hover your mouse over it, you can see that the, UR, the actual URL is different than the one that's being presented here. Now, um, me as a, as a developer, I know that this URL string is not what it would be like on this website. However, most people would not notice. So one easy way to do it is just to hover over and you'll see it's a tiny URL which is showing you that it's concealing something. Now if it doesn't show you this when you hover over you can right click on the link and click copy link and then you can go to your web browser and you can just paste it here but don't load it and you will see here that it's a different URL then you can just close the tab so don't get tricked into believing this is an actual order and you can simply disregard it. If you're still not sure, you can look up the name of the person, either this name or this name. Now if you click here, you can also see that this is .nz, which um, I believe is New Zealand, but it could be somewhere else. So it's another indication that this person is not from your country. and another reason to close this and delete the email. However, since we want to show you that this is an actual phishing attack, we will go ahead and click on this link here. As you can see, it's taken us to a page that looks like the standard Magento administrator login page and uh, it's asking us to provide the username and the password. Everything may look legit and if you're a Magento website owner, many people will think, oh, okay, this looks familiar. But however, please keep an eye out here for the URL. You can see here that this is not the URL draperycurtainrods.ca or .com. It is another sort of URL right here, which is a hacker's website. And keep in mind, this can be done for any other e-commerce platform like BigCommerce, like Squarespace, Wix, or any other platform that you can think of because these hackers can look up your website and figure out which platform it's built on and then they can just replicate the login page to make it look like the standard login page to trick you. And once you enter your details here and click login, they will have access to your website and they can do anything they like with it. So this is the last step to look at here, which will tell you that this is in fact a hack attempt. So make sure that this URL is legitimate if you're going to log in. Now, we also advise you to have an antivirus installed like Bitdefender, which can actually integrate with your browsers like Chrome, Safari, Firefox, and Internet Explorer. And if this ever happens, you will get a message here saying, warning, uh, this is not a legitimate website. And we have disabled this for now just to show you what it looks like for the average person who doesn't have a virus scanner installed. Now right here if you click that you can see that this is saying attention malware this page contains viruses or other malware. We hope you found this short video useful and if you did please like us and subscribe below. Thank you and have a great day.